All right, hello there and welcome to the video. It's Final Fantasy 13. I'm Internet Slayer Brad Pritchard. Guess I'm not fighting these pointy guys. What a bummer. I wanted to beat them up, but I apparently don't have the sauce. See how easy it is. It's fortunate they're all facing away from me. I don't know how that happened, but it is good news. But are there any orbs that I need? I mean, it seems like there might be orbs in this direction. There's an orb right there. Well, that's no good. Is there a flea button in this game? Because <laughs> I can't beat it. Um, holding down triggers. There's now. Now I can't run away. Techniques run away. And there, there is no flea in this game, huh? I just want want to run away. There's, there's no point in me fighting it. I'd imagine you cannot get that. Uh, particular uh, orb without I guess I'm, I'm trying in this fight without defeating one of these things which doesn't really seem like what's something I'm about to do I'll try but he did that one attack that just completely murdered me last game and I don't see why he wouldn't do it again you know seemed like a pretty sweet move for him I'm gonna try to make sure he doesn't, uh... Wow, okay, that's not gonna work very well. Is... He, he refuses to be, uh... To be staggered there, you hate to see it. As you can see, I've done basically zero damage to him. And... <laughs> It'll get there eventually. The question is, does he murder me first? And the answer is yes. Every time he has shocking breath, I am dead. Is it really over? Because I could put on a lightning or a shock ring and try to prevent that. I think it would probably still kill me. Anyway, I don't want to be fighting those. I can't beat them. I know it. I'm fine with that. I just do want to get the orb, which I don't think is going to happen. There's, there's, there's an orb. I see it. Uh, gotta go see ya. Alright. I'm down here, but, uh, I can't beat these things. I'm, uh, that's not great. Jeez! I guess he was on to me. I mean, I'll attack him, but this isn't, this isn't gonna do anything. You got me there, sir. Follow my lead, huh? And I don't think there's much of a chance of him just never doing his big attack, though. This doesn't seem like a realistic possibility. But as long as I keep him in uh, commando, I can at least keep the stagger up, but... Actually, staggering it is another question entirely because it just takes forever. It's like, that was from what, 108.1 to 109.6? Was that what that was? 109.6. Wow, that did absolutely nothing. Yeah, I guess. Oh, shit, better stop that. Oh, he lost all of his, uh, he lost all of his stun, just like that, or his stagger, excuse me. What a, what a fun idea this is. And so far I've done less than 10% damage from my eyeballing of it. He is almost staggered now, but he's got shocking breath. Of course he did. Try to save his life, I guess. So I guess maybe a, a shock ring would be enough to get this done, honestly. 
I don't need to do that. Change is good, Pops. Don't call him Pops. Anyways, if I, I guess if I can avoid dying to the shock attack, which I mean, yeah, I got a way to do that, honestly. I could win one of these fights. Just still gonna take a long time to be very tedious, though. I do get to listen to the song more, but I can do that while I'm doing anything. You only got one song. And, but if he's gonna do that a good attack again, I gotta keep everybody like at full health. Because that's really all you can do. Yeah, I feel like if I don't keep him in commando, the stagger will start going down really fast again. Is that true? I don't know. It's been my experience. You didn't get him. As long as I guess as long as they take attack Sag with he's got enough hit points to survive, just barely. But I, oh, and there went all of his uh, stagger though. For whatever reason, it does jump back up a lot more quickly after those times it goes straight down into the into the gutter. I don't really understand it, but it is a thing. I, mean, I guess if you could bring your leader back to life, this would be mostly academic. <laughs> you could just, you know, use the occasional phoenix down and get through it, but they're not into that, so I don't know. Don't call him Pops. Another stagger incoming soon enough, I suppose. But not quite yet. I have to do one more turn. And that's not going to be enough to kill him. He's still above 50%, of course. But we'll get some more damage in. I'm going to get my goddamn orb one way or the other. If I die in this fight, I'm going to be real sad. It still could easily happen, of course. Oh, he just killed me. Oh, I'm fine for some reason. Okay, whatever. Probably better heal. Hate, hate to break it off during stagger, but I would like to stay alive, thanks. He still got plenty of hit points, so I gotta get one more stagger, which easier said than done, of course. But. He does seem to have switched his focus to Vanilla, which is not ideal. But I guess put his shock ring on her and this will work fine, right? Gotta make sure her health stays at full though, which is annoying. I mean, it's not like she even has more hit points though, I mean, she just has less resistance to shock breath? I don't know. That's too much again. Stagger, not really getting there. Not gonna be able to kill him without Stagger either, but you know, we're halfway there, I suppose. So yeah, I guess this is, I wouldn't even exactly call this difficult. I would call it, oh, am I gonna survive? Nope. Oh, that hurts after all that time, jeez. Is it really over? <laughs> it's over. That's true, we got, we got killed. All right, so I mean, the only reason that worked as well as it did is because the guy insisted on attacking and sad. As soon as he gave up on that idea, that was over. Okay. Still gonna try to sneak around and get this orb, because I'm an idiot, but... I tried to open it? Oh, I'm not allowed to open it because he's right next to it. I kind of forgot about that rule. All right, I guess I'm just not gonna get that right now. How's that sound? I mean, at least I can have this one, right? Uh, 
Oh, okay, I don't care about that. <laughs> yeah, I meant to jump up there, I'm sure. Alright, here's some gremlins. That should be a little uh, easier for me, I suppose. No more hard fights, thanks. That was enough of that for the time being. I imagine if I put the shock ring on, I could probably uh, escape that. But I just don't want to do it again. It takes too long. They'd probably give me a lot of uh, valuable C points, but uh, yeah, I, I, I fought three of them, it's enough. And I don't know, like even with when I put on the, the shock ring, obviously I'm going to be taking less damage from that attack, but I'm going to have less hit points too. Second accessory uh, spot might be necessary to make that actually work. But we'll never know. For now, we're just gonna fight some dumb gremlins. Hey, hey. Almost had him. Way to go, fast. Hey, you called him by his name instead of Pops. Now I'll tell him, take that. There you go, that's the stuff. Well that wasn't scary at all. That's true, it wasn't. It's just a group of three gremlins. Let's see what kind of garbage I get in this orb. It's ten scaled wings, baby. That's like um uh, six gremlins. I can count, right? Oh, I'm pretty sure I snuck up on him there. Sad doing the real work as usual. While I sit here yelling, aha! Sad's taking a beating here though. Be fine. Only two gremlins left. They can't get the job done. Actually, I mean, they, if they hadn't switched uh, targets to Vanilla, they could have taken him down, but they didn't. They did that, so that's fine. Leather and hides, etc., etc. I got no C points. I don't know. That one statement from Sag is where they decided that every video game made in the last five years needed some kind of camera so you can take pictures you don't care about. Anything in this corner? Why do we even have this corner? All right. Plot. <sighs> Indeed. You look tired. Not enough sleep? I guess. Not surprising. You go like me. It's hard to close your eyes, huh? Okay, yeah, you weirdo. Oh, I'm just gonna lie down for a bit. Not easy. Can you tell that old chocobo? I mean, look. Even I'm kind of worried. <laughs> but even if we don't know what'll happen, we have to keep our dreams alive. Jesus Christ. Come on. <laughs> something to look forward to. You know? That's yeah, a deep philosophy you have there, young lady. Next stop is Nautilus. City of Dreams.
Yes, jump on her face. Just like my cat does. What? Sass? Nope, just left her. I can't blame him. Guess it's down to just you, Vania. Good luck. Okay, I guess I'll go to the plot place for the <laughs> from the beginning for the first time. I need to get need to get Sage back. scared me. What's up? I'm just thinking. Don't blame yourself. You know, you can't control who a FLC picks for a focus. My son Dodge. He was picked. He's in the sea. He said he wanted to see a foul sea. So, I took him to go on a tour of the Uriday Gorge plant. Thought I'd surprise him with a chocobo chick to take home, but... The second I turned my back, into the energy plant he went. <laughs> really? You've been paying a lot of attention there. Lassie had snuck in and tried to attack the Sanctum Falsi. It did the only thing it could and gave Dodge and Lassie to protect it. Sure, that makes sense. My son, he got picked by a Sanctum Falsi. He's a hero. But where Pulse Lassie Dodge's enemies. Psycom showed up right after that to take custody of him. And then, it was one test after another. Even then, they couldn't figure out his focus. Maybe it was look for. I hate her little tie so much. Maybe it was kill him. Either way, how could a kid that young even stand a chance? After he was made a lassie, Dodge had some way of sensing things from Pulse. He was the one who found the Pulse foul C. But the kid can't fight. So, that's why I put myself on the train to Purgeville. I figured his focus had to have something to do with destroying that Pulse Falsi. Thought I could do it for him, and, well, you know the rest. If I was right about his focus, he's probably a crystal already. Of course, if he was supposed to take out that thing with the sea, then either we die, or he's a seat. Die? Really? <sighs> it's a pickle, all right. But the bird, the bird says no. Man, this is one of the central problems of this game is that their plight is not at all relatable to anything in actual human experience. So that's a little rough. And I don't think it's good writing. And I'm not going to save at the save point. 
Oh, now let's uh, eat this right. orb. Drink some of this water. What is that? <laughs> it's an orb. That makes bad weather. Forgot to bring our ponchos. Come out to play in the rain, did you? <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Kinda. I vaguely remember this, and I don't really get why it's a dynamic, though. Gotcha. Frog got substantially more hit points. But it's gonna be just fine. Maybe. Saz is getting his ass beat as usual. But his stagger lasts forever. And this other frog is almost dead anyway. Alright, fair enough. The, yes, the head frog is completely worthless. No good at anything. fluids of all sorts. Man, why would I want to change the... Man, okay, let's we'll say I change it. It's sunny now. I mean... Would I rather fight these guys? If so, why? I don't think so. Can I jump up here? I, can. But I don't really want to fight that guy. These nasty I mean, I have a choice of fighting between two different groups of not particularly difficult enemies. <laughs> Why? I guess there's oh there's oh there's one of those pointy things down there, which is not something I noticed. I guess that's the whole deal. All right, well let's see what's up here. If there's a pointy thing, I'll run back down. There is not a pointy thing. I guess if they if they hid some orbs around with treasure in them, I'm gonna have to you know, deal with it, I suppose. He's doing the courtship dance. I hate to see that kind of thing happen. will be staggered soon enough, I suppose. This fight is taking a bit. There. Oh, that's, okay. Staggered. <laughs> was sitting on exactly 160%, but apparently that was not good enough. I got swamp water. Oh, more courtship dance. Wait to see it. I don't really know what that does. I thought it was maybe summoning more, but that doesn't seem to be the case. I got down to 165 HP. I probably shouldn't even get down to that low. It's probably a bad idea to tempt the fates that way. Okay, so there are more, and I do want that orb right there, so I guess I gotta use the switch. Bummer. And then you have to watch the animation every time also. I mean, it's like, what, four or five seconds? So that's four or five seconds more than I want to spend dealing with it. Four of them, that seems like a lot. I mean, I'll be fine, obviously, but... You're gonna have to do some healing at some point, that's for sure. Yeah. 
Alright, that guy's dead. We'll do this for just a second here. Get some healing done. Start working on the next one. They do stagger pretty easily, at least. Still, Saz getting his ass beat, as usual. We'll heal him again after I kill this one, hopefully. And two left, that should be fine. Oh, you know, Saz just got targeted again. They're, they're after his ass, that much is for sure. I mean, this, these two on their own are doing a pretty decent job of beating Saz up. It's going well for him, I'd say. It's not going to end all that well for them, but, you know, sporting effort. Saz, you're wasting your, your attack. I was trying to avoid him doing that, but in the end, I achieved nothing. Getting there, still gonna take a little more time. To me, it looks like casting Fire Oz is a bad idea. I mean, it looks like it did less than 200% of the damage done by Fire, so I don't understand why you'd ever cast it. I'm going to keep doing it because I'm just gonna hit auto battle, but it made a lot of sense to me. Alright, Orb. Got a metal armband, what's that do? She probably doesn't need the Ember Ring on. Resist Deep Track plus 30. Uh, I already had one of those, huh? Well, put this on, just in case I run into one of those pointy guys. I mean, obviously I shouldn't be, they're pretty easy to avoid. The whole premise of uh, the Weather Orb. I don't think things are going to go well for them with only uh, two guys. Got their ass. This guy was staggered also? Why? I have to look up my abilities and see what the what's the point of fire if it's actually worse is my question. Hey. Clearly, the game doesn't treat it like it delivers more stagger because it uses it in the exact opposite situation. I don't really understand. I mean, it says staggered targets take more damage. And it says to target. <laughs> okay, I don't know. So it sounds like it should be multi-hitting, which is good. I mean, especially for fights like that. Hey, look, there's something scary. Uh, am I supposed to fight that? Oh, I didn't want to do that. I thought that was a different kind of orb. Is the thing going to disappear? I kind of want to fight it. I mean, I, if I die once, I die once, right? I'm assuming that I should not be fighting it. It's going to beat my ass from the looks of things. Try to see if there's any orbs back in this direction. I don't really see any, but I'll fight these frogs. I don't give a shit. Yeah. I don't even be sneaking up on anybody. I mean, as long as I'm hitting multiple things, Fire Oz is fine. He would be casting it over and over again. Which I can. Oops. Yeah. 
I don't even, I don't probably know what these guys are. Uh, they're, they're not really bothering anybody, to tell you the truth. No, they don't like fire on Saz doing great. He's just doing fantastic here. Alright, well. He's not in grave danger, but I may as well heal him. I don't know. It seems like thinking more and going into abilities is not a great solution. It's better just to <laughs> just do the auto commands and let the computer do what it wants. <laughs> Got him, finally. Alright, wasn't pretty, but we got out of there. And I don't even think there's any, any delicious orbs for me to enjoy. Well, honestly, I don't want to fight that guy. It doesn't look like there's any stuff, huh? No, no, just, just stay going this way. Alright, I'm going to try to fight the dragon-looking thing, because I'm an idiot. And after I lose, I will come back here and touch the magical orb again. I, I'm sure I've got this fight under control. Hello, want to fight? Or you just run right by it? What? Okay, finally. <laughs> I guess I can just run right by it. I don't think I can defeat this thing. Let's see. That wasn't so bad. Casting some spells. Unfortunately, I've been defense downed, which is, doesn't seem ideal. And Saz is putting all of this stuff on me, and I don't think I need to be an auto hinder anymore. Okay. All right. Well, if you can just if you can just hit me for 530 damage, I guess I won't be able to do it. Fair enough. I thought it was worth a shot. You probably can do it with great effort, but uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. We'll just fight the easy fight like I'm supposed to. I'm not very happy with my paradigms though, because her saboteur, like you only want to use it for just like a second. Because it, it does debuffs onto the enemy, and if you're fighting one enemy... Oh shit, I'm right under it. Okay, I guess I'm trying this again, unfortunately. I'll run away more effectively next time. So he's de-shelled and de-protected already. Well, he doesn't seem to be de-shelled, really. We'll try it one more time. That doesn't seem to work. Fine, fine, fine. We'll let him keep casting his things uh, while I try to heal up. He just needs to get his faith up, or maybe bravery, whatever it was. And then we uh, start doing attacking. I don't. There's no way it's going to work, right? But it's worth a try. It looks like it's fairly easy to stagger, though. The question is, am I going to die before I even get there? So right now he can just one shot me again, which you know, not great. Here comes bite, is that all it takes? Yep. Alright. Let's let's try to run away more effectively. I was confused and facing the wrong direction before that. He's got a weird like mouth coming out of his back just like I do. Can I effectively get out of here is my question. I wanna go back to the weather device, you know? Which is, doesn't seem to be particularly easy to do. All right, I'm gonna make it this time. Can't beat Wyvern, you hate to see it. Those Wyverns apparently more impressive than the Wyvern Riders in Master of Magic. All right, I'll fight you chumps instead, because it's easy. But I feel like if I cast fire on them, I can, I can stagger them all, maybe? 
you know? I'll try that. Is that true? I don't know. <laughs> Can't really tell who's staggering and who's not. I mean, I guess with maybe some of the, uh, some of the brace, I have like the 30% uh, deep protect resistance one could actually help me. I don't know. Is that true? Don't courtship dance me, motherfucker. Okay, courtship dance does summon one of the weak ones, which I'm not going to worry about for obvious reasons. That was three of them? Okay, that's a lot. I might have actually heal this fight, which is obnoxious, but no big deal. Definitely gonna have to heal some of this fight, because this is not looking great. Saz looking pretty bad, but he'll be fine. Oh boy. Alright, we're back down to two enemies. Attacking the mud frog. So far, not effective because nothing's sticking to him. Uh, Court chip dance, is that gonna work? I don't think it only works once per fight. Oh no, he got he got some new friends. It worked just fine. <laughs> what am I talking about? Got to do some healing again, obviously. After this. One is dead. She now is. Just the weak ones left. I don't think they've got what it takes to cause any real problems. Sad, just, just murdering them, obviously. So, that'll be fine. Got his New York Nick guns. 144 C points. All right, well, we got 912. I'm already here. Let's go to the the bogus sphere grid. That one's full. That one's not close to full. That one's full. Okay. All the garbage ones. That's all I got out of 900 and some points. That hurts. Burning through these pretty fast, huh? That one's done. That one's done. Okay. Give me my 10 hit points, please. Wow, that used all of my points just like that? Okay. Seems like that was a rapid rate of taking them compared to in the past. And I did not get very much for him. May as well wait till well past 1,000 to bother with that in the future. Unless it's something I really think that's going to help me immediately. Should maybe just avoid more fights, because I'm not sure any of these are even worth it, but it's fine. <laughs> At least this one's gonna be quick. Oh, it's got a different gremlin, doesn't it? It's got a better gremlin? Yeah, that's a something else. It actually can hurt me. Still not too worried about it, honestly, but probably fought one before and didn't even notice it. Did Sag actually stagger somebody with his commando attacks? What the hell's going on here? See an orb over there? There's a terrifying swamp monster as well that I don't want to fuck with. So I'm gonna have to do a little of this. I mean, I see the point of this mechanic, but also it's another thing where like just pure 100% unadulterated video game logic. Oh yeah, there's just some orbs out here, you know, that that let you change the weather. So if you want to don't want to fight that guy, you can fight this guy instead. <laughs> there's there's no rhyme or reason to it. It's just a thing that's there. And the game doesn't even really try to uh, justify it, I don't think. 
just just things things you can find in this world that make no sense guys going down to zero on his all right well went quickly back up to 140 on his dagger so we will love to see it Caught me in the face there. I knew it. I mean, I feel like they just give me the C points, though. They're like, <laughs> if they can't give the fights more variety, they should just give me free things, okay? I guess that's kind of like the Chrono Cross method, where like normal random encounters just don't matter at all. <laughs> you just ignore them if you feel like it. But I feel like I should be able to ignore them. But I am, I am getting some experience. That's not what it's called in this game, obviously, but that's still what it is. Aqua Ring? Am I going to need that soon? Like, maybe once every five fights, like, oh, shit, they're hitting me a whole bunch. I guess I better switch to healing. And, I mean, obviously, this has been a problem for not just Final Fantasy games, but simply JRPs in general since, you know, the beginning of time, more or less. They hit me pretty good there, but there's only one left. Oh, no, that's not true. He survived. Here. Here uh, <laughs> like, you know, random encounters just have never been all that personal except for means to gain uh, some amount of uh, experience and levels, right? And they're traditionally not particularly challenging, unless you're tremendously underleveled. Now, that's probably something I liked about um, even maybe really old JRPGs, like the, take the original Dragon Quest. Uh, like, you know, everything was kind of gated off by bridges. If you crossed a bridge, you need to be find, running into a bunch of asshole enemies that perhaps you couldn't deal with. It was, you know, it was at least a system. Okay, it's like there's an orb over there, but it's past the wyvern. Uh, there's more right here, too, though. I didn't miss any orbs, did I? I don't think so. So, like, if you wanted to, you could grind your way up and really uh, go take on a gold man or some shit. Oh, that's not great, is it? Well. Not ideal. Can I sprint right past this guy? I don't think I can. I think his gremlins will catch me. I do just want to sprint right by fights. I don't want to do any fights right now. I'm just, I've, I've done enough fights. And it's, you know, it's enough. <laughs> it's enough fights. And that, that's looks like the game's treating that with respect. But anyway, I don't want to fight this. I've already fought over here to get my orb. So I'm going to avoid that so that this wyvern's no longer here. Alright. Didn't have to engage in any unwanted fights, at least. Oh, that guy's still here. Because I'm... I can't run around him. Sure I can. I don't even know anymore. Okay, we're just gonna stand here. See what we got. Okay, everything's fine over here. Let's just fight. Am I have to fight all seven of these guys at once? No. They are two separate encounters. I feel like the game's already starting to kind of wear me down with its, the repetitive nature of its combat. That's why I also just, like, the, the, this problem was solved best, in my opinion, by Final Fantasy XII. The gambit system made it so you didn't really have to behave like this. And it was also, it was quite easy to get away from random encounters if you wanted to, but, um... In both this and in Final Fantasy XII, you kind of do want to do random encounters because you do want the experience. But, I don't know, it gets to be enough after a while, right? I mean, you really age us all. Oh, we're getting this one. Okay. This is a lot of mud frogs, by the way. 
and they're gonna keep calling their friends with their courtship dance, which is gonna be pretty irritating, I would think. Taking a long time to kill this one of them, isn't it? So far, they're not summoning new friends, but they are beating the shit out of me, so I guess I better, after this attack, do something different. I'm back. Not quite enough to stagger. We'll get him next time. Not enough, huh? Alright, well, I got him. Down to two. Sad a little bit hurt, but I think we'll be okay. I don't think they can do 350 more damage. Unless they summon friends and we'll have to rethink things. Oh, they summon friends. Of course they do. Just be responsible. Quite make it to stagger, huh? Blitzed his way there. And once again, not quite enough. Wonder if I'm targeting the right enemy. It appears I am. Yeah, we're taking a bit of a beating. And I'm inclined to play it safe here. I don't want to go through this again. Yep, summon some more, because of course he did. He keeps getting shot while he tries to do it, but... but uh, did it stop him? It appears to have interrupted him. I don't see any additional friends of his. Don't really understand how interrupting things works in this game, but... Wait, he managed to summon one friend in time? I don't know. I don't know how it works. I feel like I've been in this area forever. I will drop a quick save. He likes fishy things, fair enough. And that's kind of how the last section felt, too. Oof. I should have put on my water protecting ring, huh? Uh, no. yeah, that's not good. It's fine. It's friendly enough. We do. Oh. All right. I got it. We sneak. I don't think it's gonna work. What do you think? It appears to not have worked. Just too much to ask to cut me one break, isn't it? Come and get it! I vaguely remember this fight, which is more than I can say than most fights in this game. Oh, he's got thunder attacks. This one's got water attacks. What a surprise, surprise there. I obviously am not protected from either of those things. You could argue that I should be... Wow, that hurt. Fix myself up here. And fix up Sag, it appears. They did write another song for the game, and it's a pretty good one. I appreciate it. This stagger still right on up there, so this should be fine. You got him. Probably should be doing something a little more like this, right? Got to do it twice in this fight, of course. 
doesn't like lightning. I don't have anything to help with. Oh, I do have thunder these days. Okay. Got a, they got a few hit points on him, and I gotta take a little break here from the attacking to make sure I survive. You know that thing. Yeah, there's a lot of hit points out here, I suppose, which is not ideal. His stagger nearly over and didn't do that much damage. Eef. That's not ideal. <laughs> Let's try to put some statuses on him. It's a, it's a boss fight, right? Keep myself alive while I continue to put buffs on. Oh, my da my defense is down. You hate to see that kind of thing happen. Oh, I can I can assume my way to victory. How about that? I have a Suna. I forgot. Just a moment here. Sorry about that. I don't want to. Well, I guess I do want to cure. I wanted to get this soon on him, but they keep hitting me. So you know how it, how it goes. There we go. Alright, back to actually attacking for the first time in a while. Are we attacking the wrong one now? Why are we doing this, you idiots? Attack the attack the one we we were attacking before. Don't don't be fucking stupid. <laughs> I don't like the looks of that. Oh, he's just buffed himself significantly. Not great, I wouldn't say. This fight's not going very well. Like, I'm not, like, dead or some shit, but this is going really badly. Like, they have way too many hit points. Obviously not the first fight that's gone badly for me. <laughs> I've had quite a few so far. It looks like you should be fairly easy to... Uh, that doesn't seem good. It's bad. <laughs> it is bad. I'm in bad shape here. Alright. <laughs> Back on the attack. You got the stagger, but look at him, he's still well. Well, not well, though. I think slightly. Right around 50%. It is very, very close. Not gonna be able to kill him this time, I don't think. I mean, obviously, once one of them's dead, the fight's pretty safe, but. We're not right there at the moment. They're constantly trying to murder us. It's not great. Yeah, better stay in, in healing. This is gonna hit me. Or not. Get a little more damage in during this stagger. Not a lot, unfortunately. Time is running out, but I can still, still get one more bar of attack then. That will be it, unfortunately. And he's still alive. And he's enraged. Yeah, that hurt. But everybody's fine. Everything's cool. We're fine. We'll be fine. We're gonna get the with the W here. He'll be staggered in a couple, maybe one more round, maybe two. And that stagger will certainly be enough. Yeah. Are you doing that again? Oh, he staggered. And now it's just time to finish him. And then we'll be fine. I'll heal up and start attacking the other guy. The worst part of this fight was that time that they started attacking the other uh, enemy. <laughs> that bothered me. Are you dead? Yeah. No, you are not. All right. Let's go back to 
doing some status stuff before we start attacking. I got blasted though, that's not gonna last for long, but I de-shelled. De-shell is, did not work, mind you, but I tried. There we go. And do some healing. Got a lot of healing to do, unfortunately, so we need to cast Asuna as well. I need that as soon as now. Sag is just getting blasted and it sucks. There we go. Let's actually attack now. It's been a while. Okay, looks like a similar amount of difficulty in staggering him as compared to his friend, so that's fine. And that's the problem with a fight like this where you're dealing with a. Uh, uh, boss that's like double is that <laughs> once the first one's dead it's just that wow and maybe everything's not fine he just fucked me up there as long as they're allowed to attack more often than they deserve to i guess they can do just fine because somehow he's attacking every other second But it's gonna be fine. I mean, yes, they can. That, that's one way you can solve that problem, though, is, is make it so that the uh, enemy can be a total asshole uh, as soon as the first one dies. <laughs> the, the remaining one can just be a dick. This guy seems like he's maybe a little softer than, geez, right, than the first one, but I don't know. Still kind of an asshole. Gonna have to assume it myself before I switch back out of this. And new. He's doing. Okay, I don't know what the fuck has happened there, but it's fine. He does seem to have fewer. Probably should. Oh, I don't even. I mean, water is the right attack, right? Yeah, I somehow know his. I, I guess when you do. When you use Libra, it does it to everyone, not just the one you're aimed at or whatever. I guess he is hasted, by the way, so I guess I should give him a break on attacking way too often. It hurt, but I'll be fine. Staggered, that'll be the end. Yeah, okay, you're gonna hit, hurt me again, but I'll be fine. I still got a few hit points left. here to make this end <laughs> instead of doing nothing. I don't think that's going to kill him. If it does, I'll be real sad. Alright, we're cool. Give me just a second here. Alright. Three stars, not, that's not very many stars. Should have I got a uh, Riptide Ring and a Foreman Ring. And my Crystarium's expanded. How about that? I mean honestly that was relatively smooth sailing as boss fights go fights go for me. A hop skip and a jump, and we're in Nautilus. The city of dreams. If only we were dreaming up those clouds. Whatever that means, buddy. <laughs> I still don't really have that many points. Let's check out those new items. They sounded just like protecting you from element items, but let's be sure. Resist lightning, 25%. Resist water, 25%. All right, well. They were what they sounded like, more or less. Okay, you do that. I too am running. 
All right, I will be next save point. I will be stopping this particular video, of course. It is getting right around that time. There it is, Nautilus, the city of dreams. Well, climbing over oh. I don't suppose there's a hole anywhere in this fence. Maybe. I mean, yes, I suppose there is a hole in this fence, it turns out. <laughs> All right, Saz, smart guy. Try not to touch the edges, I would recommend. I'm not sure I'm coordinated or careful enough for this particular activity, but they seem to do okay. You can board the ship over there. <laughs> okay, there's just... There's a, a station with ships. It's guarded by an electric fence from one direction, so you can't get to it. This world makes so little sense. So precious little sense. Listen, it's been raining for half the time in the last place we were in. I do generally think this game is just an all-timer for uh, video game logic. Sass, do you hate posts? Why wouldn't I? Look at this mess it's gotten us all into. Because the game has scarcely explained what pulse is, like zero percent. Of course, it's not to say I always hate. Seemed fishy. All that sanctum ranting about the threat from Pulse. Only a matter of time before they strike. Pulse is infested with monsters. Scare after scare. Not even a shred of proof. Tired old cynics like me? Mm -mm. We don't just swallow that tabloid crap. Why didn't they actually make him look no, old, for example? Like I figured the Sanctum was up to something crooked. <laughs> At least until I got dragged in. Yeah. Now that I think about it, all this purge business, it really only happened because Dodge found that Pulse Foul C. You're wrong. Huh? Don't blame him. I did, didn't even sound like that was what he was doing. Yeah, you're right. It was that scum from Pulse behind it. <laughs> I might as well have tried to stop the rain. I fought the tears. They still fell. You're getting soaked. <laughs> true, true, that's true. I'll be fine. It's only water. All right, and that will do it for the video. I'll drop a save here and call it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you'll be back for the next one. If you've got anything to tell me, put it in the comments, and I'll see you later. Bye.